Thanks. Hey, I heard. I can't believe this. Oh, my next headache. Don't worry. We'll get through it. <laughs> Everyone? Everyone, meet Darcy McGuire. Hi. Oh, my goodness. Everybody showed up. Darcy, how are you? Nice to see you. Darcy, it's a pleasant surprise. Hi. God, welcome to the small world. Welcome aboard. Hi. I'm so glad to meet you. Hello, I'm Darcy. Hi, I'm Nick Marshall. Oh, I've heard a lot about you, Nick. Oh, and I've heard a lot about you too, Darcy. Well, don't worry, can't all be true. <laughs> Let's hope not. Hey. Hey, standing room only. It's a first. I'm very, very excited for you all to meet Darcy McGuire. I know Darcy's extraordinary reputation as a leader in the field precedes her. At BBDNO, Darcy led a creative team that snagged $500 million in new business wins, and that was just last year alone. Mm. Here at Sloan Curtis, we've always prided ourselves on our strategic thinking. Now it's time for us to step up and once again prove ourselves creatively in the marketplace. And I'm thrilled that Darcy mm. has consented to move across town, join our team, and lead us into the 21st century. <laughs> Thank you, Dan, and thank you all for that warm welcome. Let me start off by saying the feeling is mutual. I'm absolutely thrilled to be here. When I first started in this business, it was my dream to work at Sloan Curtis. In fact, I believe I even applied for a job here twice. Somebody call personnel. <laughs> <laughs> but it was BBDNO that offered me a home. And what I learned there was that any success I had was a direct result of the team of people that I work with. I know that two heads are better than one. I know that five heads are better than two. And I know that if we put our heads and our hearts into this company, we will deliver. I know that. Now, I love challenges. I love hard work. I look forward to sitting at this very table, tossing ideas around until what I fear will be the wee hours of the morning. <laughs> but most importantly, I want the work we do to say something about who we are, how we think, what we feel. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. <coughs> Excuse me. So, as our friends in Hollywood say, let's cut to the chase. How are we going to turn this company around? When Sears decided to go after women in their advertising and said, come see the softer side of Sears, their revenues went up 30%. 30%. That's huge. Female-driven advertising totaled $40 billion last year. And Sloan Curtis's share of that was... Zero. If you want to sell an anti-wrinkle cream or a Ford Mustang to a woman, forgive me, but this is the last place you bring your business. And we can't afford to not have a piece of a $40 billion pie. So I have put together a little kit for everybody. Nobody panic. This is supposed to be fun. Every product in this box is looking for new representation right now. And they're all made for women. I'm pretty sure all the women here are pretty familiar with most of these products, so for the men, let's just briefly run through them. Here you go, Nick. Each kit contains anti-wrinkle cream, mascara, moisturizing lipstick, bath beads, quick dry nail polish, an at-home waxing kit, a more wonderful wonder bra, a home pregnancy test, Hair volumizer, oh, pore cleansing strips, Advil, control top pantyhose, and a Visa card. Now, I want everybody to come up with something for one product, for two, the whole box, whatever moves you. We'll get together tomorrow, have a little show and tell, and see where we are. How's 8.30 for everybody? Great. See you at 8.30 tomorrow morning. 